They braced as the lumbering giant began its descent into the dingy nobody sky. Paul looked from the window next to his seat at the haunted world they were leaving below. The nobody hole unfolded before them as they zoomed above it. Sketching his design castle nears. The fall ship flies. A killer smells fear. For now all is quiet. A battle comes forth. Black magic and knives. The beginning of a war. And a nobody dies. Clutched over the wheel, the old man steers Smoking on his pipe, a sweet aroma filled the air His blood raced with the excitement of flight Born to be your pilot, or what's the point of life? Right. jack o lantern danced in a corner humming Something of a specter, like raven feather She almost felt the pulse again thumping But any sign of life from her is closer to a supernatural gesture Paul smiled for the first time Teeth uneven as dying blades of grass Wondering if it's all a dream And if I wake up to a bell ringing sleep Sleeping in his class Chin propped up on elbows Whistling at the window Breath steamed on the glass The bone castle loomed the head Like a giant among gods Frightened by no gods So high in the dark fall The titan dwarf gets his tiny fall Shipped like a mountain Next to a dragonfly It was so large That Paul's heart skipped a beat When they flew into a shadow That's when he heard a rattle He turned around baffled A sliver of a silver glimmer Sent a shiver in his spine To the center of his gut his heart skipped a beat. Man ran into the room, expressionless the mass. Through the jagged dagger, Jack Atlanta acted fast. Right before the knife stabbed Paul in his place. She teleported in between and caught it in her face. 
stump. The handle vibrated when it stuck. Smiling while she pulled it out like apple stems. Look, Geechee turned around, astonished with a scowl as the howl rolled beneath him like the hellish version of a rug. Mad it didn't miss a beat, he saw the witch and swung. The witch became Miss, miss. the Panda Man missed. Miss. She popped up behind him, trying to creep, but he peeped just in time and caught her with a savage fist. Bam! Landed to the deck, the knife skid is close. Man that picked it up, maybe pick me Paul is toast. Geechee trying to concentrate on landing, cause they at the foot of Bone Castle now, and if he leave the wheel, it's over. Well, the killer slashed Paul across the chest, a little off his mark, cause all these pieces of a dress wrapped around his throat at the last second. A thousand magic strands choked in, yanked him by the neck. Pow! The ship landed with a crash, old man Geechee screamed loud and opened up the hatch. Handed Paul the sketchbook, told him get out while he can. Jack O'Lantern looked into his eyes and screamed. Yes. Paul ran into the cold, even while the tall castle made of bones stood above him and he bawled. After climbing a high hill of human skulls, he finally felt safe enough to look back at the brawl. Ice knives flew from the pumpkin with his fingers. Man, it took them all like he never even felt them. Old man Geechee's corn pipe grew into a hammer, yelling to the heavens like a grizzly when he swing it. Thunderclap, boom, lightning bolts flashed above. Man, just stabbed Geechee in his chest, his body slumped. Ripped off his arm like a flimsy piece of paper, faced the witch while Geechee's blood gushed from the stump. Exhausted from the magic spell, swaying in the wind. Rain started pouring and she looked up at the kid. Too tired to fight, what a pitiful sight. Drenched and sad, the little candle in her face went dim. Man, they grabbed her head, she said, run, run Paul, now. now. Frozen in place, he couldn't move one inch. The killer held a limp body over the house. Chopped the head off with a growl and threw it deep in the abyss. Nobody home. 